Hi, I'm Martin George. I'm Collections and Research Manager at the Queen Victoria Museum and Art Gallery, but my real passion here is that I'm manager of the planetarium and uh, an astronomer. I've been interested in astronomy since I was perhaps about six years old. I loved drawing maps of the night sky and learning about the constellations, watching the planets and so on. And it really has become my, my lifelong interest. I love looking at the night sky whenever I can and, and having a look at things through telescopes. Here in the planetarium, this is a great place to come and learn about astronomy. We have a special projector called our Zeiss Planetarium Projector that shows the night sky up on a dome-shaped ceiling which acts as a screen. It's really realistic. It's like being out under the stars. And we can talk about what's visible in our current night sky, where to find the Southern Cross, the Milky Way, the planets and various other features of our sky. Here in Australia, we're very lucky because we have a great view of the Milky Way. In fact, we're the envy of Northern Hemisphere astronomers. The Milky Way looks so much better from here. And that's something we also talk about in our programs. So part of our program in the planetarium each time is to look at the night sky as it appears at the moment from here in Launceston. But the other part is a recorded show about some aspect of astronomy. We have quite a variety of shows here in the planetarium. Our latest one, called Capturing the Cosmos, is all about how we study the sky, especially from here in Australia, and not just with optical telescopes, but with radio telescopes as well. We have a program called We Are Aliens, which talks about us being aliens compared with other potential civilizations there may be out there, and how we've perhaps searched for other living beings on other planets. So there's quite a variety of programs. We also have a great space display here at the planetarium. There's been a lot of astronomy done here in Tasmania. We have old telescopes. We even have a rocket that's been used for experiments that are sent into what we call a suborbital path so that they can get above most of the atmosphere. And lots of information about radio astronomy here in Tasmania. There's been a lot of research in that and also optical astronomy as well with the new observatory at Bisdi Tia, uh, just about 50 kilometres north of Hobart. We're a major centre for learning about astronomy, something we're really proud of. And thousands of people every year come to see our shows.